In this video, we're going to compare the male Dutch Shepherd to the female Dutch Shepherd. In general, males are more affectionate, playful, and friendly compared to the female. The females are a little more standoffish, a little more unsure, more intense, and they like to do things their own way. So in this video, we'll compare their temperaments, trainability, size, and overall differences so you know the difference between the male and female Dutch Shepherd. So let's get started with their temperament. As we look at temperament, we'll start with the male Dutch Shepherd. Male Dutch Shepherds are just more relaxed, stress-free due to their outgoing nature and their impeccable sense of fun. But these dogs are high intensity, always on the move, and they love to explore. They're up for any adventure and they're so easy going, it just makes it nice to take this dog and do whatever you need to. But don't let their easygoing nature fool you. They're still incredibly smart and they're protective when they need to be. So if you're looking for an easygoing dog that can still get the job done, that is the male Dutch Shepherd. As for the female, they're smart, driven, and direct. They can be somewhat of divas as they're full of antics and attractive flamboyance. They're definitely affectionate as well without being needy and they like some alone time or independent time as well. Females can also do really well with other dogs and children but they may need just a little bit more time to interact and to warm up. They're less trusting and require effort to win them over. So overall females are smart active dogs that want a job to do and they want to do it well to please their owner. Next, we'll compare the size of a male Dutch Shepherd to a female Dutch Shepherd. In general, a Dutch Shepherd is considered a medium-sized dog that's teetering towards the large size. Their height's anywhere from 20 to 25 inches, and that's both with the male and female. The weight of the dog is anywhere from 65 to 70 pounds for a healthy male or female. But in general, the male looks bigger, fills out a little bit more, has a bigger head, and just stands bigger than the female. But like we said earlier, don't worry, a female carries her own weight and can hang with anybody. They're an intense dog and the weight and size just doesn't really matter. So if you're looking at a Dutch Shepherd, whether you're looking at a male or female, they're generally the same size and it's not a noticeable difference like it can be in other dog breeds. Look at the trainability between male Dutch Shepherds and female Dutch Shepherds. We'll start with the male. Males are easy going, eager to please, and it may require less reps to train them on anything. They are very active and they need a lot of exercise, but they are up for any challenge as long as it's with their owner. So if you train a male Dutch Shepherd, things will go a lot easier than if you train a female. Females are more stubborn. They're very willing to please and they crave a job. They're still very active, but they want that job to get their owner's approval and it may take more reps to train your female to do something than the male. But in general, as long as you get this dog plenty of exercise, keep them active and they're with you, they'll be easier to train than most dogs because they have a high drive to please the owner. Next, we'll compare the male Dutch Shepherd to the female Dutch Shepherd and whether or not they're a family dog. We know this is an active, intense dog that can do a lot of things out with their owner. They can be hunting dogs, herding dogs, guard dogs, but are they good family dogs? We'll start with the male. Males are generally really good with kids, other animals, and dogs around the house. They have an easygoing nature, and as long as they're socialized early, this dog will have no problem with other people, kids, and animals. As for the female, like we've said before, they're a little bit more standoffish, need a little bit more time to warm up. So it's very important that if you get a female to socialize this dog early, if you socialize them early, you should have no problem and your Dutch Shepherds, whether male or female, will be great around other people, kids and animals and they'll make for an excellent family dog. And finally, we'll compare the lifespan between the male and female Dutch Shepherd. Dutch Shepherds want to be active, they want to be socialized, and they want a family. So if you keep this dog active, give them good food, get them regular checkups, then this dog will live anywhere from 10 to 15 years. Dutch Shepherds are an excellent dog breed because they're a perfect size, they're very smart, and they love families. So it's up to you to keep them active and keep them healthy. If you do this, you'll have a long and happy relationship with your dog. We hope this video has helped you understand the differences between a male and female Dutch Shepherd. And this beautiful dog will one day maybe be a part of your family. And if you love learning about dogs, make sure you hit that like button and make sure you subscribe. And we'll see you on the next one.